TK's speech. The development of artificial intelligence will help humanity. Let's begin. Have you ever used AI before? Some people might choose yes, and some might choose no. But I think the answer for our class should be all yes. You might never have heard of the word AI, but all of you must have heard this sound. This is the sound of Siri. These are the examples of AI. To be specific, not the completed version of AI, but the beginning stage of AI. One of the heightened interests in the world is AI now. Many companies and universities are jumping into this area of AI. So let's start with what is AI. Artificial intelligence, also known as AI, are intelligent machines that work and react like humans. AI can learn and solve problems like humans do. It could be both virtual and physical. The current AI technology is less intelligent than human. However, the ultimate goal of AI is to make machine which outperforms human. Many people are confused when they hear the word AI. However, most of them have AI inside their pocket. If you use iPhone, it will be Siri. If you use Samsung, it will be Bixby. Some people use it every day, while some people don't. I use it every day when asking for alarm tomorrow. Hello. How can I help? How to make a girlfriend. How to make a boyfriend. These are just simple examples of AI that can be easily found near us. AI is progressing rapidly and the world's attention is now on AI technology. AI doesn't always have to speak. For example, AlphaGo from Google DeepMind was a hot issue a few years ago. It is a machine which is specialized at playing the game of Go. AlphaGo is also one of the examples of AI which is widely known to us. Unfortunately, human lost on this battle with robot taking 4 and human taking 1. This shows the point where AI technology have reached currently. Also, there is a famous AI robot called Sophia. Sophia is a social humanoid robot developed by Hong Kong company. It is widely known as one of the most advanced AI. Sophia does understand the question and answers the question. However, it is not the complete version as it doesn't understand some questions and sometimes say completely different things. Closer, there are AI attached home appliances like AI attached TV, AI attached washing machine, AI air conditioner, and AI refrigerator. Also more familiar, AI speakers like these. Uh, they are AI, but those AI don't understand very well. I tried. Let's not get too complicated and just think that AI is a machine which thinks like a human. However, the problem is that AI comes into our society deeper and deeper. The concerns are getting more and more. The world we imagine in the movie like Terminator is coming closer. On the one hand, people are welcoming new technology. On the other hand, people are worried about the cost that AI will bring to our society. To say directly, I agree with developing AI and believe that it will for sure help the humanity a lot. Even nowadays, AI is actively influencing the human world. AI is already driven into many things. For example, AI-driven applications offer help to professional business persons, educators, marketers. Other AI-driven machines can assist a chef in blending food ingredients with perfection. Also, it can help disabled person like searching things with voice order. There are some advantages of AI technology. First, fast task. AI can provide human a great relief from doing various repetitive tasks. AI can learn and do jobs faster than human. It is highly efficient in industries. AI is also capable of dealing with complex tasks. It can handle multiple functions simultaneously. Second, estimation and prediction. 
AI is very strong with estimation and prediction. This is because it can memorize large data and it can also take the data from the internet. This is called big data technology. Also, it can make decisions based on the data. This can be used in weather forecast. AI-based weather forecast system will be more reliable than human forecasting. It is not that humans are less smart, but it is because AI can read much more data than human in a short time. Third is efficiency. Machines integrated with AI are super efficient. This is because AI doesn't get distracted. It can handle more complex jobs than normal machines. Of course, it still has high work speed. Some people say AI make people lose jobs. This is true. However, as AI replaces some jobs, new jobs like AI engineering and AI management is coming into our society. Also, not all jobs can be replaced. Uh, it might be possible for AI to replace all the human jobs in a long future. But I don't think it's possible in recent 30 years. Also, it is hard for robots to copy human essence and human nature. Our technology has been developing since humans were born and it is our instinct to develop and make us beneficial. When robots were first made, people complained about losing jobs. However, the time has passed and now it is obvious that the development of robots helped the human technology to develop. Like this, in the future, AI will be naturally helping our daily life. AI will make our life more beneficial and challenging like AlphaGo won the competition against humans. Human lost from the competition but the job of Go players is still alive. It was challenging for human but also interesting match for many people around the world. I was also one of them watching the competition. Now let's talk about opposite argument. There are people who think that the development of AI technology will be harmful for humans. AI is threatening humans. These days, AI technology is used widely around us. We can easily find AI composer, AI artists, and AI designer on the internet. These AI only takes few seconds to do those things, while humans take few hours to do. People will say, how about the quality? The quality is indistinguishable. Therefore, the identity of human creation is being threatened by AI. People only thought creation is the thing that only humans can do. However, the road has changed and now not only humans but also robots can do that. People are scared and worried about that. That we believe to be our ability became not only our ability but also robots' ability. This is a big shock for some people. There will be too much impact and changes that AI will bring to our society. So let's talk about how AI can be dangerous to humans. First, AI might be programmed to do something devastating. As AI become popular, individuals might own AI and some AI might be programmed to kill people. The combination of weapons and high intelligent machines will bring a big disaster if controlled in the wrong way. Also, there is a possibility that humans might lose control of AI. AI are also machines. Machines make errors. It will be easy when we think of computers. Computers make a lot of errors and it becomes uncontrollable. Therefore, this might also happen to AI, but the effect will be much bigger. AI might become too strong and might harm human. This is what we usually see in the movie, robots controlling humans. Maybe you can think of ladies also. Second, AI might destroy something while taking the order. AI is programmed to take orders, but they are not programmed to feel emotion. Therefore, they won't think the effect that will bring while doing the mission. Some might say we can prevent, but there is a limit. We cannot predict all the possibilities that might come. We, humans, are now the strongest life on Earth. However, 
If AI becomes more intelligent than humans, it is uncertain that we can still be the strongest on Earth. Based on both sides of the arguments, I think AI should be developed unless the human dignity is infringed. There is a quote from Max Techmark, president of the Future of Life Institute. Everything we love about civilization is a product of intelligence. So amplifying our human intelligence with artificial intelligence has the potential of helping civilization flourish like never before. As long as we manage to keep the technology beneficial. This quote could be similar to my final conclusion that AI should be developed until it is beneficial for humans. The current technology of AI is very far from the stage that we should be worried. The area of AI technology has a long way to go. Although AI seems kind of new and surprising but also familiar, that cognition will change in the future. Thank you for listening.